mud long because the pipes run far in this building. So it has to go to uh, this this line here runs into a stack, and then this stack runs into another line. But right now the pipe is maybe this big, but it's that big because of all the grease that's inside. They don't flush these lines out too often. Times we had the uh, backflow issue before our thing gets stuck. I've so, done all kinds of all kinds of uh, apartments on this main floor, right over to the other side of the building. There's another old man over there, way at the other end, and his his apartment floods out so many times. Uh, I, I had constantly doing this. It's because of the grease, right? Yeah, yeah. I understand. Yeah. But, but see what I do. Maybe you were here, but I don't know the state was here about two years ago. Yes, but you see, the problem is when we put the smaller snake in, it does. It's it's only making a smaller hole. This is making a bigger hole than the other one will, uh, yeah. right? Because the superintendent was telling me, or the maintenance guy, the onyx guy, was telling me that he's been having some problems on this line. So that's why I, I come and do this because yeah. it's a long weekend, and you know. You don't want to get stuck with it, right? So, I'd rather take a half an hour now and fix it properly than no, have to I come back. I don't have a problem with that. I'm sure you know. <laughs> I, like, I like what you're doing there. Because here's, here's what happens. You come home one day and you find your whole apartment underwater. Oh, that happens. Yes, you know. Uh, but my question is, would it help if uh, they allow uh, this water to go to the drain they're not supposed to have dishwashers or washing machines in these buildings, but the tenants keep sneaking them in. Yeah, but they're, they're, they're supposed to use concentrated detergent. They have all the filters. I, I understand that. Though. And they, they wash the... Uh, they use much uh, uh, larger temperature. Yeah, but, temperature. But here's the thing. This is an old building, and it wasn't designed for that to start with, right? So the plumbing wasn't, uh, you know, adequate for, for running washing machines in the apartment and running uh, dishwashers. You know, so when people start doing these things, and then, like you say, they have soaps and that that are, you know, not supposed to give you so much soap suds and everything, right? But people don't have don't uh, always do that and then they let their kids run the machines and they just stump all kinds of soap in there and you know that's it there's another problem some of the tenants uh, put the washing machine in the bathroom and then put the discharge hose in the toilet uh, and then the people below are calling and saying they're getting soap suds coming up their toilet <laughs>